Neurons transmit chemical signals across synapses, like the one shown in this electron micrograph. We can identify the dendrite of the receiving, or postsynaptic cell, as well as two presynaptic nerve terminals loaded with synaptic vesicles. Note the narrow cleft separating the pre- and postsynaptic cells. The synapse converts the electrical signal of the action potential in the presynaptic cell into a chemical signal. When an action potential reaches a nerve terminal, it opens voltage-gated calcium channels in the plasma membrane, allowing calcium ions to flow into the terminal. The increased calcium in the nerve terminal stimulates synaptic vesicles to fuse with the plasma membrane, releasing their neurotransmitter cargo into the synaptic cleft. The released neurotransmitters diffuse across the synaptic cleft, where they bind to and open the transmitter-gated ion channels in the plasma membrane of the postsynaptic cell. The resulting ion flows depolarize the plasma membrane of the postsynaptic cell, thereby converting the neurotransmitter's chemical signal back into an electrical one that can be propagated as a new action potential. The neurotransmitter is quickly removed from the synaptic cleft, either by enzymes that destroy it, or by reuptake into the nerve terminals or neighboring cells.